today we see the wild lily horse. Hey guys, um, I don't, I don't really know what I'm doing, but I've heard a lot about this girl, lily horse. And, um, so today I'm on this, the superior gaming server, I think, yeah, right there. And, um, so, uh, I, uh, I'm on my creative world plot thing. Oh, God, so much lag. Anyway, so, um, yeah, I always see this girl in the comments, and I, I've never actually seen her before, even though she, she's my neighbor, I think. I don't know, there's a lot of people who have the same plot with her, so she must be pretty famous, at least with her friends who all got the same plots right next to each other. I think the other one's right over there, or right over there. I, I don't really know, I have a lot of neighbors. I'm popular. Uh, I'm gonna try to find it. It's got a big lily on it. Uh, I think it's that one. Because, uh, I don't know. Well, I can't find it. But, oh, anyway. So, uh, yeah. She's disappeared. Quickly, before she returns. Oh god, she's right there. Well, that's not her, but I'm gonna run away. Whew. I don't think they saw me. Whew. But anyway. So yeah, I'm just doing <laughs> random stuff and uh, I was just hiding in Gracie girl's head uh, I, yeah this is her statue of her character person <laughs> and anyway <laughs> I was, I was <laughs> It's not even that funny. I I don't know why I'm laughing. But uh anyway, I guess um But anyway, I just wanted to show you that I didn't really want to get too close to her cuz she's not AFK, but I I'm not entirely sure. Uh, you know, she could have been, but her friend's probably in there, so she was just probably talking to her, you know, typing in a command or something, because that, that girl was not there before. She was probably just typing in her TP. Um, so, yeah. Um, anyway, that's just all I wanted to say. I wanted to share my discovery with some... Oh, that's what I'm doing. Sorry, guys, I'm on a laptop, and, uh... <laughs> Uh, my, my, uh, my mouse pad is very inconveniently placed, so, um, when I'm, you know, doing my keyboard movement with the, with the WASD keys, I, uh, my palm touches the, uh, the, um, mouse pad, I mean, mouse thingy on the keyboard. So, um, yeah, I guess it wasn't really lag, even though it's kind of lagging. I don't know, but... Uh, still there. <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, guess that's all. Unless you want me to show you, I guess I could show you. Um, anyway, this is my creative plot. Um, when I first started, I wanted to make a big castle, so. I just made this big th ring over here. Didn't realize I was right next to the border here. But, you know, that didn't really matter because I was going to make it all in here. But then I made this part. So it's a uh, spruce wood, oak wood. As you can see up in the top corner. Can't really move my mouse to it because, anyway, this is spruce wood, oak wood. So it's half spruce, half oak. Then, um, you know, so then the first thing I ever made was this little bathroom, so you'd come down this hall, I never made a roof because I was too lazy, 
anyway, you come in this hall, you would go in this little bathroom where <laughs> this retarded looking toilet is, and you sit on it, use your bathroom, then here's, there's the sink. Thought I had some counters, but apparently not. I don't know, I, I'm not entirely sure where those went. Anyway, so then after that, I, uh, I invited Gracie Girl to come and, uh, build on my plot with me. So then, <laughs> she expanded this way. She had some doors. They were iron before, but then they glitched out, and I'm not entirely sure what happened. There, I, I broke them, and then there's this, like, weird rectangle invisibility thing right here, and I couldn't, like, place another door, or open the other door, or something like that. But anyway, she made this really weird couch. This isn't even the one she made. It, it looked really, really weird. But anyway, you'd come in here, and this is apparently the living room where she had this really odd shaped couch that was made out of like this wood and it looked exactly the same as this wood and then you'd sit on it and look at the door anyway I, I rebuilt this couch you have like absolutely no room to jump it's it's literally three blocks um but you know it's a half slab so uh wait just a sec yeah you have oh it's not three blocks no it's two blocks and a half slab, so you can just jump a half a slab up, which is about one and a half feet. Anyway, this is, uh, we made a guest room, I guess. Um, this is apparently the guest room with this wool and, um, yeah, here, the glowstone, blah, blah, blah. And then she made this, Grace's Corner. And then she put Welcome to the Jungle, but I had to put these doors in, so I moved it. Anyway, she made this odd pattern. So then there's the kitchen. Let me show you the sign. The kitchen. Because the kitchen is the most important thing in this entire plot. I added this little sign. Dear Jimmy, please don't eat the cake. From the cook. You go in here, you know, here's all this little cake shop. The furnace, all with 32 coal. Yeah, I'm never going to cook anything, but some crafting tables. Yeah, she made this. She outlined it with jungle wood. And, um some more cakes on this side <laughs> then I added this dear cook the cake was good from Jimmy um yeah here's the kitchen that's about it uh, anyway I don't know she just put black wool there because apparently black wool is what separate anyway I wanted to make it even but anyway so uh, I knocked this wall out and I made this little archway for my room angel faints his room anyway you go in here I made this little red carpet to my bed with actually a chest, but you, then you jump over the chest, and here's my magnificent purple bed with snow as a pillow. Anyway, so I made this little glowstone, um, glass little side, like, <laughs> can't really see out of them unless you look up, and then you see glass and the kitchen. But anyway, here's that little roof thing, uh, some patterned wool. Um, these are some uh, ores that you make in the blocks. Gold, emerald, lapis, diamond. There's a redstone block right there. I don't, I, I don't really favor the redstone block in this texture pack. But anyway, here's the chillaxation room. Um, some random seating in the corner. I, I It was a little too bland with just a couch that was way too close, close to a very big TV that's very poorly made. But, um, yeah, so I just added these little bench things. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what was wrong with me. But apparently, Gracie Girl has added this door into our laundry room with dryers, little dryer paper sheets, and clothes, you know. There's some more. Uh, these are the washers. Um, not entirely sure. And you have the hand wash your clothes, then you can dry them. Then there's the cart things, which are hoppers, and, uh, you just put your clothes in them, you know, don't know why you need that many, but, uh, what's this, oh, okay, this leads over to Grace, Gracie Girl's, um, dogs, her, her Minecraft dogs room, and, um, our friend Gavin, who's also, uh, Fluffy, Fluffy Socks Lol, I don't know how to say it, he, um, uh, our friend Hilara, she uh, she said something, and he thought she said ballerina priest. So um, 
Gracie Girl just said, okay, Ballerina Priest is my dog in Minecraft. So she made this little bed, and I made this little staircase made of snow. And, uh, you know, this little bed, uh, her very own room. Um, Ballerina Priest room, she's bad. Anyway, so there's this little story. I was at my friend Angela's house. And, um, we were playing, um, on this server. We were playing in my creative world, and, um... This is her room, by the way. And, uh, yeah, so, she, um, I put, okay, so I wanted a kitchen before we made the kitchen. And I made this little, like, uh, servant quarters thing, but I destroyed it because, I mean, uh, it said, and anyway. So, um, so I put, I put on her bed, Dear Grace, could you please make a kitchen slash dining room? Love, John. And she told me to put John, so I just put John. And I don't know a John, except for this guy, John Thompson, in my school. Wait, he doesn't go to my school. I don't know. I forgot. But, yeah, um... Yeah, and then, uh... There was a sign that said, Dear Grace, I added a guy named John to our plot from Angela. Um, yeah, and then she went on this huge rampage. She's like, Who's John?! And I kept telling her, John, John is my friend. He he's weird though, cause he put I put love John, and no one says love unless they're like in kindergarten, or just really really weird. But anyway, she's like, who is John? I have no idea who this John is. And we got our friends, um, we got to Lara and our friend, um, uh, he doesn't really have a YouTube, but I'll just call him by his real name. Um, we uh, to Lara and our friend Christian in on it. And, um, they're like, oh, yeah, John's like, John lives in our neighborhood. There really is a John that lives in our neighborhood, which I really didn't know. But anyway, so, um, so, yeah, she just went on this huge rampage. Then the other day, she, uh, I, I, this is my Minecraft diary. I can't name it yet because, I mean, I haven't, um, signed it yet. But, uh, I had her read it to see if she could read it because it was mine. But you open it, and, you know, this is me telling my diary that I lost to this guy in Supercraft Bros. He's actually really good. And then it says, Dear Diary, today I am waiting for Angela's mom to... Oh, no. Okay. Dear Diary, I made up a fake guy named John for Grace. She thinks he exists. I told her that I added him to the plot. She went crazy. It was really funny. Goodbye for now. Anyway, so um, she read that, and she was like, John isn't real. I knew it. And I was like, yeah, you actually thought he was, and she really did. But, yeah, that's the whole story behind John. Then she made the kitchen. Anyway, this is her chandelier, and then I broke it the other day. So then I put this sign up here. It says, I fixed your chandelier. And then it says, from Angel Things. So, um, uh, yeah. So this is a little <laughs> one-way hallway, and that's the place again to uh, our rooms I wanted to make this secret redstone place for it but as as you don't know I fail and I am terrible at redstoning anyway this is my bathroom my very very um, blank unfurnished bathroom so anyway you come in here here's a little shelving unit place for all your cosmetical needs and a random sink well, of course you need a sink, otherwise that would be insanitary. But anyway, here's my um, here's my clothing shelves, um, some clothing hooks, some a toilet, and a little flushing thingy. But that just flips the lid in case you're too cleansiness. That's not a in case you're too cleanliness freakish thing to lift the toilet seat up by yourself. Anyway, going on. This is my book room, and you just go in here, it's a one by one, eight, and it's just a room full of bookshelves. So, um, this is a sign room, I'm not going to read all those signs, even though I hate it when people don't read signs, because they expect you to know that you know their personal life, but you really don't. Um, anyway... So, oh, anyway, this is, this is the pool, so you just step on in here, and this is the little kitty area for little 
children in Minecraft. Then this is your pool area, you know, stuff like that. You got a little walkway around it. Ugh. Let me up. Let me up. Then here's the diving board that's very poorly made because it's only a 2x2, two by 2x2, two, uh, two whatever. Then you just jump off, you know, that's a regular diving board in Minecraft made of cobblestone. Then this is the disco dance room. Do, 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 do. And you have two doors because because I didn't really want to have like this little area for, you know, randomness in between it. So I just made a two door thing. But anyway, uh, I made this little rainbow um, floor made of wool and, you know, I messed up a couple times. So, yeah, there's, you know, anyway. So you got these jukeboxes full of music discs, and you got a chest in the back full of music discs, and this is where the the, the um the DJ guy stands. Uh, uh, uh. But uh yeah um in case you didn't notice, I am a DJ Panda, and uh yeah my DJ headphones. But uh anyway, that's the disco dance room. <laughs> it's such a stupid name. Uh, anyway, so this is the hot tub. I didn't really have a good design for a hot tub, so I just filled it with, like, these little sta uh, stairs that you can sit on, but uh, you have to stand on them because, I mean, uh, anyway. So, um, then underneath is the lava that's flowing through the glass and heating the water. And, uh, I was too lazy to make it too wide, so I made it one wide. But, uh, yeah. Ugh. Um, I guess that's it for over here. It's kind of cramped, but, you know, there's really not really much stuff. Oh, by the way, over there is my little parkour thing. Uh, not parkour, it's like a hurdle jump. But anyway, you come back into Grace's corner, and there's the kitchen again. Uh, there's the outdoor park area, you know, stuff like that. And then you go in here. Uh, I'm a little too lazy to actually go through it. So then you go in here, and you remember that book room down in there? Yeah, so then you you have to come all the way through there, go through the archway, then go in there, and then come back out, go in here, la la, then go into the reading room, where you have a reading room, you just sit down, um, you know, read. And if you're too lazy to go all the way to the book room, you've got these little handy-dandy bookshelves, so you can just pick a book and start reading it right away. Or if you're even too lazy to do that, you can just go to the book room and sit down on the floor and start reading if you really want to get into the book. But, yeah, anyway, this is it. So, yeah, these are two fountains, and <laughs> you go down here. And, uh, you fall down, and then you do, don't look, no, it's, I'll scare you, I mean it, fine, hi, did I, were you scared, boo, ha, huh, I scared you, what, I did it, ah, dang it, but, yeah, here's another ender chest, and that's a little secret area, uh, anyway, so, uh, yeah, that's about it. Uh, bye for now.